Cheeksters, hi YouTube, it's Chi Chi again from Supple Chic, and today's video is going to be the long awaited holiday party outfit video. Without further ado, let's get into the video. I wanted to start off with the ugly Christmas party outfit, right? I'm doing ugly Christmas party, but make it fashion. So I went with this gorgeous um, black sweater that has different colored pom-poms in it, very reminiscent of a Christmas tree. I'm calling this an ugly Christmas party outfit, but make it fashion because, you know, it has some elevated elements. So the main focus of this outfit will have to be this cropped long sleeve oversized sweater. If you've been following me for about a year, you probably remember this sweater from my pretty little thing haul. Actually, it was from my ASOS because I picked this up from ASOS, my ASOS haul last year. Anyways, since last year, I've been wanting to style this sweater, but I just didn't have the right bottoms for it. I knew I wanted to wear it with something super high-waisted. I'm not in habit of like showing my stomach so I, I just feel like it's best to save the world that sight so anyways I paired it with a pair of high-waisted pants um, that came with a belt I tied the belt around my waist instead of like buckling it and I went with a pair of black pumps and a red bucket bag the next outfit is going to feature this sweater that I have on here Honestly, guys, you need, when I say you need, you need a sweater like this, something that is easy, but it has like, um, you know, festive touches. In this case, this sweater has like woven bits of metallic thread going through it. Um, so every time like clockwork around the holidays, I always reach for it. I think I've had this for like two Christmases now. I always reach for this sweater. It's a must have. I paired it with the, um, black slip skirt um, that you guys have seen a hundred billion times. This is my current uniform, okay? And I'm not sorry. <laughs> and then I went with my cowboy boots, yes, okay? Instead of going with like my, you know, over the knee boots like I would normally go for, or just like a typical boot, I wanted to have a little bit of fun and add a little bit of a, um, a little bit more shine to the look. So the boots are vinyl, the skirt's sil um, satin slash silky, the sweater has metallic threads. So this is a great way to infuse festive elements into your outfit without like being so, you know, so, what's the word? Overt about it, right? Instead of going for like sequins and anything that's super like over the top, you can still have a little bit of fun with shiny fabrics and festive fabrics. Now to finish things off, I went with a velvet bag. So again, I'm showing you all the ways that you can incorporate festive and luxe touches into your look and not look like, you know, you got thrown up by Santa. If you're wondering, where's the shine at? Where's the sequins at? I wanna look like a walking disco ball. I got you. It's coming. It's coming. By the way, this wig that I have on right now is exactly the same wig I have in all of the looks. I just played around with um, a couple of bobby pins and turned it into a bob because I'm seriously um, considering turning it into a bob. Let me know in the comments below if you think I should or if you think I should leave it long. And this unit is actually from Mega Look Hair. This portion of the video is sponsored by Mega Look Hair. Um, if you want the full rundown, um, on this wig. I did a whole dedicated video. It's called my festive get ready with me um, Where I show you how I went from hair to makeup to outfit. We did a little chit chatting You can watch the whole process if you want more outfit ideas for like maybe you have like a festive gala coming up Definitely check that video out. I will keep it in a card above my head or down below for you to check out. But this is a 13 by 6 full lace wig. What I love about Mega Look Hair is how affordable their hair pieces are. So if you're looking for bundles, if you're looking for wigs, they've got you and their prices are really good. P.S. This hair holds a curl like no other. Okay. And one of the reasons why I typically only do synthetic hair is because I'm lazy and I don't want to curl my hair and also I'm not that good at curling. So I love the fact that this hair, like literally I just has to do a couple of touch-ups and it looks, look at, look at that, look at that. Okay, I don't want to mess up my bob. Um, but it still looks so, so good. So make sure to check out Mega Look Hair by clicking open the description box 
down below because I got you and I want you, okay? If you want to slay into the new year, definitely check out Mega Look Hair. Ooh, that rhyme too. Okay, your girl's getting better. Okay, getting better. All right, so let's get into the sequins because I know that's what y'all came for. So the first look is going to be a sequin wrap dress. Now, literally, this dress broke my version of the internet on Instagram, okay? As soon as I popped up this dress, everybody was coming at me left, right, and sideways okay it's a gorgeous sequin dress and you know around the holidays we tend to go a little bit darker or we go for like red and green but i love this sequin dress because it's a break from what we typically see and i definitely am someone who likes to do who, who likes not to do what everybody else is doing and this dress is a perfect example of that it is a rose gold slash copper sequin dress and I decided to play up those colors by pairing it with orange accessories so my pumps are printed but they have like an orange base and then I went with my orange like a neon orange clutch so in this look honey you will not be a wallflower when you walk in the room everyone will notice you. And what I like about this dress is that it is a wrap dress, so it's going to be so flattering. You can leave the Spanx at home in this dress if you want to. Like, there is a time and a place for Spanx, don't get me wrong. Uh, but if I'm gonna be out all night, I definitely wanna just wear something where I'm not pulling at my Spanx, my feet ain't hurting to death, all those kind of crazy things. So everything, again, will be linked all the details um, for the pieces in this look will be linked in the description box down below. Let me know, are you a sequin statement type of girl or are you a little bit more subtle? Let me know in the comments down below. Oh my gosh, so we've gotten this far and I didn't introduce myself. If you've come this far, hi, my name is Chi Chi. If we've never met, I am the blogger behind SuppleChic.com and SuppleChic TV here on YouTube. So if you like fashion, beauty, and lifestyle, then please consider subscribing down below. If you like what you see so far, hit that subscribe button. So this next look is perfect for like a New Year's Eve dinner. So I never thought that sequins and subtle could go in the same sentence, but these pants definitely embody that, okay? They are like a matte ivory sequined high-waisted wide leg pants and the best part about these pants yo they're actually long enough like you don't know the struggle because there's nothing that i dislike more and wide leg pants that are like high waters when you wear it with heels i kept things super simple and went for a cream turtleneck sweater which i just did like a half tuck and then for shoes i went for a silver tone pump as you guys can see that those pumps have a chunky heel so i know that even if i'm wearing this all night i'll be comfortable and you know and cute comfortable and cute. Now, if you plan on going out and dinners, you're not stopping at dinner for New Year's Eve, then instead of a sweater, like cream color sweater like I went for, I would go for like a silky button down shirt. And then if you guys wanna transition for a night out, you can unbutton a couple of buttons, rejig the whole you know, outfit and maybe layer on a couple more necklaces and you would be perfect for a night out on the town. As far as bag, I just went for this um, mini box clutch. I find like mini box clutches, elevated look. They take them from like club to dinner or gala, you know? If I'm going to a club, you could do like a big pouch, you could do like a big, a bigger bag, but if you're going to like a fancy dinner or you're going to like a gala, I always suggest a smaller bag. So I question of the day, what are you planning on doing for New Year's? this year. Let's continue our conversations down below. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to be right there. Let's chit chat. Uh
If you like this video, share with a friend, read my blog. If you're looking for outfit ideas, gift ideas, holiday deals, and more, then hurry, click that description box down below and visit the blog. Rate, comment, and share. And here's where I'd say stay blessed, but I don't want you to go anywhere. I don't want you to leave. If you want more outfit ideas, definitely check out my fall and winter outfits playlist down below. You can check out my 2017 and 2018 holiday outfits video for more ideas. If you love hauls, you can check out my Cyber Week haul series. Just like this video, I try on all of my pieces and I style the pieces for you as well. Everything will be linked in the description box down below or in a card above my head. And if none of those things interest you, in a second, YouTube will suggest a video that you're sure to love. So get comfortable. Go get yourself some snacks, a warm cup of cocoa, and keep on watching.